If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the subscribe and bell icon for more videos. Peace out, guys. Hey guys, I'm Mickey McBack here for another video. Guys, real fast before I begin this video, I am running a double flashback Cam Newton giveaway on Xbox One and PS4. Little eye icon in the right hand corner, or of course at the end of this video, there will be a screen that pops up that gets you to the video. But nonetheless, guys, what I want to talk about today is actually what happened to me last night. So I was playing this guy Funky, and pretty much he we had a back and forth type of game. He ended up coming back in the end and having one last drive to go down the field and maybe score and win the game. Now, no big deal. He was actually going right down the uh, field on me. I was expecting to lose the game. I was thinking like, okay, I'm going to lose this game. No big deal. Whatever. It's just another game. But then he ended up disconnecting from my game. Now, I figured, you know, my connection's not the best. It's kind of booty cheeks. So probably what happened was he ended up just losing connection to me. Well, Funky decided to send me very, very nice messages telling me how I DC'd him from the game. Now, obviously, I did not DC him. You're going to see in this clip right here that I did not DC him in any kind of way. I was told, actually, that was patched, by the way. But nonetheless, I did not DC him. He thinks, he thought I DC'd him. We went back and forth, and usually I don't reply to messages, especially when people are mad about a game, because I'm just like, whatever, dude. But this one really hit home because I I really don't think people understand the difference between disconnect, DCing somebody, DDoSing somebody, and lag switching them. First off, d disconnecting from a game. E either way, you might get a win or a loss. That is actual a thing. Before this whole glitch went around where you could de uh, desync people or just kick them out of the game... That was actually a thing where you could lose connection to somebody else. And according to Funky, he has the best connection on Earth. Well, I don't. Okay, and if you disconnect from me, you will get the game will end. And I guess because I was winning, you got a loss. That's just how that works. Now, of course, there was a glitch going around where you could desync someone from a game, boot them from a game. That is actually a thing. That was actually something that happened. And I think a lot of people, and I see a lot of things on Twitter, I think a lot of people see that and then they think, oh my God, I just got, uh, you know, desync uh, de from the game. I just got DC'd. In reality, what happened was you could have just got, you know, you could have just lost connection to your opponent, just willy nilly, no, nothing weird, and you could have got a loss for it. So I think a lot of people see that and they just instantly think that they got DC'd and not that they just, yeah, not that they just got disconnected. And that's what happened in this game. As you can see, right here is actually when it happened. He ends up running forward, right? And I'm like, okay, whatever. He ran forward. And I'm picking my next play. I'm going on to my next play. It starts to lag a little bit, you know, kind of weird. And I just pick my play like normal right away. He calls a timeout. I'm like, all right, you know, time left. It makes sense he called a timeout. And then he just disconnects. And I thought, like, maybe he dashboarded. I thought maybe he was angry at something. So he dashboarded. Well, apparently, he thought I did or, or desynced him. Uh, and then DDoSing is when you direct denial of service. That's when you cut someone's internet from them for a 30-minute period. So I just want to make this video, guys, just to tell you, if you get desynced, if you disconnect from your opponent, it's not 100% that they did it. It, it could be that they simply, you lost connection to them. Now, don't get me wrong. There are people out there that do DDoS, that do desync, that do all this kind of crap. But just don't 100% assume the second it happens that you just got desynced. You got DDoS. You got this, that, and the third. Just don't assume that right away. Because this guy, he assumed I desynced him or DC'd him. And you're seeing on this video, I didn't do anything. I didn't DC him. I didn't do anything. But obviously, he assumed that I did because of the fact that he disconnected from me and got a loss. Which, again, I assume that's because I was winning. I'm, I'm assuming that's why EA gave me the win. Now, obviously, this is just one case. This is a case where it's the opposite way around, where I was in the right and my opponent who thought he was in the right was in the wrong. But there are all cases where it's the opposite way around where, you know, the person does get desynced or the actual person did maliciously desync the other person. So don't always assume either one. But just remember, sometimes you're not you're not getting desynced just because you disconnect from your opponent. My connection is not the best. It's really bad. And that's probably why me and him lost connection. It was just probably random that my connection failed 
And because I was winning, EA gave me the win. So just keep that in mind, guys. I just want to make the video just to get out there. Okay, I see a lot of people on Twitter just going to town saying that, oh, this guy's trash. This guy is a, you know, blank, blank, blank because he desynced me from the game. Sometimes that's not 100% a fact. It's not always true that they desynced you. You could have just disconnected normally. Before that, before that was a glitch, it just, you know, it was just disconnecting. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're new. Hit the like button. I'll see you guys in the next one. Sorry about this rant, but I had to get it out there, guys. Peace out, guys.